I've seen numerous popular YouTubers basically saying that people like Tucker Carlson, Chaya Chaya Rachik, I don't know how to pronounce her name, she's the one who does libs of TikTok, and Matt Walsh are actually happy with the tragic incident at Club Q. That because they've fear-mongered about the subject of child grooming, they don't just have blood on their hands, but they're actually happy with these results, and they would have been happier if more people would have been killed. And let's be clear, the fear-mongering has been over the top, much of it filled with false statistics. In the first version of this video, I had said that Tucker Carlson had made a claim that millions of kids are being put on puberty blockers. And uh, it wasn't Tucker Carlson, it was Matt Walsh in an interview. So, but uh, yeah, it's, it's not millions of kids, it's less than 18,000 in the last five years, which is still a big number, but it's not this huge epidemic that many people are making it out to be. The propaganda has been very effective, and it seems likely that the guy who shot up Club Q could have seen some of this propaganda, but we don't know that for sure. I think we should be careful of what we label as tocaustic terrorism. Otherwise, we won't be able to criticize anything about any historically oppressed group. And I've met people who actually believe that way, that you should never criticize anything about any historically oppressed groups. Every demographic has problems, and if we can't talk about those problems, we're never going to be able to solve those problems. But I suppose we're supposed to just sweep everything under the rug. Have a joy, joy day!